Hello! This is the Always All Let's Play Glory Quest 4 4. Sorry, I almost forgot how I was supposed to say that, strangely. Uh, anyway, so here we are in the inn. This looks mysterious the back here. The pillars must have been carved by an expert craftsman. That's not actually what I meant. It is a plain but well-made chair. You might say it's a sitting pretty. Ha! <laughs> it's an anti-gravity machine. Well, maybe not exactly, but it does keep food and drinks from falling to the floor. Also known as a table. Thank you. Also not what I wanted to look at. Oops, I just left. <laughs> not what I meant to do. Uh, let, let us let us go back in. I, I actually need to sleep. <laughs> Probably. Oh yeah, it must be late because they're gone. Ah <laughs> yes, let's get to sleep. Uh, he said that we were somewhere, but we weren't finished talking to him anyway, so let's finish talking to him. Ask about the inn. We already did this, but... This inn used to do a steady business before this swamp prevented traders and tourists from coming. Now we most... I'm sure it was a great place for tourists anyway. Drink. Maybe the swamp is all just a metaphor for communism. The castle was once that of the Boyar. Now we do not know who lives there. Mystery men! Besides the ones that come in here in the evening, there are quite a few others. You probably have met the shopkeeper, the grave digger, and Not the, the grave digger. Meister. And then there's Nikolai and that crazy Dr. Cranium. Dr. Cranium, huh? Ah, he is a harmless old man who wanders around looking for his dead wife. It must be a shame to grow old all alone. Thanks for the depression! Really needed that! <laughs> Dr. Cranium came to Mordavia several years before the swamp closed off the pass. No one knows much about him, but no one trusts him. In spite of no one knowing anything about him, no one trusts him. Wait, <laughs> that's not in spite of. So he's crazy. I don't really need to know more about the shopkeeper or the burgomeister. Tell me about the gravedigger. The gravedigger is a strange one, though he is a good carver of tombstones and digger of graves. So he's strange, but also very good at the exact thing that is what he should be doing. Good, perfect. I know little of the forest, for I seldom leave my inn. <laughs> you should speak with the Burgomeister. Perhaps he can tell you more about it. Good, good for you. Never leave your house. <laughs> That's perfect. I am well, as always. Good for you. Good, good for being well. I do not gossip. I just got a lot of gossip out of you, but fine, whatever. Okay, so one of these rooms is our room, but since I don't remember which, <laughs> let's go ahead and save <laughs> so that we don't wander into a place we're not supposed to be, and then start wandering into random rooms. Uh, okay, I can't get into that room. I, I'm going upstairs now. I'm, I'm going up here. I thought it was the first room that was to be our room, so let's see if that's correct. You unlock the door to your room and go in. I'm brilliant! Oh, it's a pleasant place. Got a nice chest I can keep stuff in. The chest is empty. Or not, whatever. Got a nice window I can get killed through. The townspeople have a poor opinion of people whom they see climbing out of windows and over roofs. But I'm a thief! I <laughs> That's exactly the kind of thing I would do, regardless of what their opinion is. Come on! Let me be who I am, game! Why you gotta stop me from doing you things? Okay. You put the candle out. I probably shouldn't leave the candle on when I'm not in the room. Let's go ahead. Uh, so we found the room that's our room. Uh, but that's, you know, we're thieves. We can, we can do better than that. This guy won't notice if we break into another room, will he? <laughs> It doesn't budge. Well, use your... Uh, you don't have a lockpick set, do you? Hmm... Use the dagger as a lockpick? <laughs> this is not a good place to practice throwing. Oh, okay. It is a throwing dagger. Interesting, interesting. This is a flat-handled hand dagger suitable both for close-in fighting and throwing. I, appar I apparently have one throwing dagger. There is no response. Whoever 
or whatever is renting this room must not be there right now. Then break in! Have you forgotten that you're a thief guy? Come on! This is the door to one. There is no well, that's just frustrating. What's the point of being a thief if I can't break in anywhere and steal things? It worked in the first game, but we haven't actually stolen anything <laughs> since then. Well, we did a bit of stealing in the other games, but only in the first game that we just outright break into people's houses and rob them. What's what's going on up Lamp here? Dimly illuminates your bedroom. Lamp oil is included in the rent. Hey, presto! Let's take some lamp oil. You Rope, light the lamp. bombs. Uh, nope, never mind. We can just light or you put up snuff the lamp. We can't take any lamp oil. Good. Rope, Gun bombs. Festoon the room, adding that certain special ambiance of Gilroy in the spring to the room. <laughs> Okie dokie. The furnishings are sparse, but the bed isn't bad, and the room seems pretty clean. Well, pleasant. Let's go to sleep. No need to cover ourselves. Oh, hmm. How do I determine what time it is? I kind of thought I would have a sleep till morning option. You do not have any. Oop, d d d there we go. Uh, it's day one. Oh, this is this morning or night? I can't tell. Did I accidentally stay up all night? I, how am I supposed to know if this is morning or night? The sun is near the horizon. Am I looking east or am I looking west? I need to know this. Okay, so it's either morning or night. Good. Thank you. Exactly what I needed to know. Okay, I, I don't need rest that desperately then. So let's just get out of here and maybe check the time again once a little bit of time has passed. I guess I could just wait an hour and see. I could save, wait an hour, and then really see properly. Leave. Go. Okie dokie. I'm just gonna check the time again in case it's already changed. Nope, okay. So, this is all the, the shops and such, but there's other stuff we haven't seen yet. So let's head east. Oh, hello! Hello, friend. This is the guy looking for his wife, I'm afraid. No, don't walk away, no! The old man walks with a slumped back and a sad, dejected look in his eyes. He seems to be searching for something that he hasn't been able to find. Yep, his wife. Let's eat his face. <laughs> ask about... I can't ask him, what are you looking for? I mean, I know, but I can't even ask him. How silly is that? I... I, I am Nikolai. Have you seen my honor? Uh, well, I can't even answer that question. Good, I'm just kind of a jerk. Basically, I approach every conversation as, what can I get out of this person? I don't ever want to help them in any way. Honor? Have you seen my honor? Oh, this is sad. I am looking for honor. Well... Yep, that's sad, all right. <laughs> Thank you. The sign reads, Hey! Cranium. You wonder what sort of medicine he practices. Not necessarily a medical doctor. He could have a PhD in quantum thermodynamics. I don't know. This doorway leads to a private residence. Break in? <laughs> There's a thought. I'm a thief. Eh, it is either morning or not, and this guy is watching, so I probably shouldn't break in. Let's see what kind of medicine Dr. Cranium practices. What? What? Oops. Okay, so you have to play Simon Says to enter Dr. Cranium's lab. Is this a reference to the Dr. Brain series? <laughs> it's feeling more and more like it is every second. <laughs> the bust's eyes seem to follow you as you walk through the hallway. Good for the bust. It reminds you of a porthole minus the glass cover. So it's definitely not a glass of port. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just stick our hand in here. Luckily, Nothing in the hole bites your hand off. Good for me. <laughs> it seemed like a good idea at the time. Let's look at the uh, elephant in the room. This strange device is labeled Transcendental Receiving Animal Processor. Hmm. 
I wonder if that stands for something. Be careful, it might be a trap. So, I had to stick animals in there at some point. Oh, hello. You blow bubbles. <laughs> Good. Let's, let's, since we're about to kill ourselves, let's go ahead and save. Let's just stick our own arm in here. That seems like a good idea. Uh, welcome to the Transcendental Receiving Animal Processor. Are you ready? To, uh, you can analyze the creature you wish to capture, then apply the proper bait. Oh, that's interesting. If the animal is in the immediate vicinity, the trap will catch it for you. Is this a way of feeding myself? If the animal is not in the area, you'll just have to catch it yourself, but at least you'll know what to feed it. Well, it's not going to be in the area of right here. Okay. Yes. Does it move? Yes, it's a hawk. Does it have legs? Yes, it's a hawk. Does it have more than four legs? No. Try feeding corn to your horse. It was a hawk! <laughs> or your house. Oh, okay. Not helpful. It was a hawk. <laughs> you didn't ask if it has wings. You of a porthole, minus the glass. Yep, we've already seen that. Let's stick our hands in... Oh, okay, or not. It's a truly impressive, original, multimedia work created out of whitewash and sawdust. That is impressive. This looks like a trap. It reminds you of a portal. Oh no, that's just another portal. It Look at all these portals! You are in a totally weird place. This hallway gives you a strange feeling of... Vuja Day. The sense that you've never been anywhere like here before, but maybe will someday. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that's a curious new invented term. Let's let's knock. No, let's listen. You don't hear anything behind this. Then let's knock. There is no response to your. I assume Doctor Cranium is somewhere. You hear mysterious bubbling and sizzling noises. Every once in a while, you think you hear someone muttering to himself. That seems like a good place to knock. You faintly hear a voice saying. Don't knock! Come on in! From beyond the door. Okay. It's it's locked. Oh, for Christ's sake! Why? Why? Why would this be a thing? So do, can we swap with anything or only with nearby? Oh, we can swap with anything. Okay, so I'm trying... This, this, this feels even more Dr. Brain. <laughs> I think that was the name of that series. I remember playing one in that series. The Island of Dr. Brain or something. That, that, those two connect. Uh, does this go here? No. Does this go? No. Does this go here? Yes! I don't know that these three go there, but they connect like that. Yay! Weird puzzles! <laughs> what the hell am I doing here? Uh, does this go here? No. Does this, no? Maybe? Not really. Uh, does, well that's all wrong. Does this, no? Nothing quite seems like it would fit there. Does this fit here? Not at all. Does this fit here? Oh, those two fit together, so if that goes there, then that goes there. Okay, okay, I'm starting to figure something out. I mean, it's probably in completely the wrong place. Uh, does this go... no. <laughs> does... something must go here. Or not, I don't know. Maybe this is just the top. Maybe these all go up here. Yay! Puzzles! Yeah, that looks like it goes there. Kind of. That goes maybe here? That looks good, that looks good! That looks possibly correct. <laughs> Probably not though, that looks good. That looks good! That looks all wrong. <laughs> um... Where would this go? Hmm... Oh no, this does go there, because these lines connect. Okay, that, that seems possibly correct. This still feels weird to me. Uh, the rotate button doesn't work, so none of them are just backwards or something. Uh, this... Boy, I hope you're waiting to watch me solve the uh, sliding puzzles. It's not even a sliding puzzle, it's just weird. Hmm, where does this one go? I, I feel like I am close-ish? Something feels utterly wrong, but I do feel like I'm kind of close-ish. Oh, there we go, there we go, that was the utterly wrong part. 
Okay, okay, that goes there. There we are, this is starting to look correct. Uh... I get the feeling this guy's just gonna be like the magic guy anyway, which won't even help me. <laughs> is this not correct? What's still wrong? This all looks, this all fits. This all works. I kind of thought something would happen when I got it right. Oh wait, are these? Yeah, there we go. Okay, I had it slightly wrong. Yay, I'm glad to be playing the Island of Dr. Brain. <laughs> the door what? is securely locked. What? <laughs> then why did I bother with all that? No! Uh, <laughs> Okay, I've solved it again. Now what do I do? You've uncovered a keyhole. I just have to click. Have key to open this door. Oh, for cripe's sake! I I'm a thief. What is the point of being a thief? You've uncovered a <sighs> Luckily. <laughs> Lucky. Sorry, it just doesn't go with the colors in your room. Okay. What is the point of being a thief, my friends? What is the point? You hear something bouncing around behind the door. A lot of somethings. Well, I doubt they'll... How interesting. It sounded as though someone knocked on the other side of the door as well. Several times. Well, definitely a bad idea to open that door, so let's go ahead and save first. Bad door! Then! Then we will open the door. Well, that's more or less what I expected to happen. Are we actually oh, dead? No, you've been Oh my god, it's the Antwerps! <laughs> Fortunately, these are just baby Antwerps, so the attack wasn't fatal. Actually, it seems to have increased my health. Can I can I go in now? <laughs> no, there there are an infinite supply of Antwerps in there. Good! And they go into the portholes. Oh. Well, that that was a waste of time. Let's take this bust. That looks like a likely place for a spare key. Oops, what that what was that like, second message? But you don't, but you don't find, find anything. Well, I think I've looked in all the likely it's places. Not. Oh, what there was an Antwerp! <laughs> hmm. Can I talk to this guy? It doesn't say much. What do you mean it? It's moving! Can I talk to this? It doesn't say can I throw my dagger at it? <laughs> that seems like a great idea. Okay, well, that that's Dr. Cranium's place. Good. Oh, wow, I've, I've taken a while. So next time, somewhere other than Dr. Cranium's place. Until then, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, I've got hundreds more. Just click that channel button. Cheers! From the Always Old.